West Hampton Tech softball team went into Friday's game with Del Rand with a chance to capture the first division championship in the history of the program. And after a narrow escape in the fourth inning, a force at home and a huge bases loaded strikeout from pitcher Brooke Hampton, it looked like the Panthers just might. We were definitely frustrated by that, but you know, something with this team has had all year is we don't give up and we play all seven innings of every single game and you know, they were able to come back and, and score runs. Um, and come away with the win. Del Rand's next chance came in the next inning. ZZ Schrader hit a two-out single and stole second with Brooke Acker at the plate. I really tried to not overthink it. Uh, I just knew that I had to move ZZ as far as possible with one hit, so I really tried to focus on hitting center of the ball and driving it. Acker's hit put the Bears up one run, and Del Rand doubled his advantage with help from a pair of Panthers errors in the sixth inning. From there, the Bears got behind pitcher Lindsey Kramer, who allowed just three hits. West Hampton Tech got just one runner as far as second base. Um, I know they can hit, and I know that I have to work the insides and the outsides on every single batter and not take anyone lightly. Um, I think I've gotten stronger throughout the season, and especially with my team growing behind me, it's just like a whole different aspect. Delran wrapped up its first Burlington County Scholastic League Patriot Division Championship since the 2004 season with a 2-0 win. The Panthers still have the Tech Tournament and the playoffs to look forward to, but that first divisional banner will have to wait until next season. They handled it well. We just couldn't put the ball in play. Um, I feel like they put too much pressure on themselves maybe a little bit going into it. In the beginning of the season, we didn't really have anything to lose, and we went out there and played softball, and now we kind of were literally second-guessing ourselves, and you can't second-guess yourself when you're playing softball. From the Burlington County Institute of Technology in West Hampton, this is John Lewis.